What is up, booby goaters? I'm here with Nixon, and I forgot an ingredient. Hold on. So what you see in front of me was a novelty cheese that we found at Aldi's. And Nikki totally wants to eat all of it. No, no. It was a pumpkin spice cheese. I'll pop a picture of it. No, no, not eat. I know you're not gonna eat it. It's got like, I think three grams of carbs in it, and it's pumpkin spice flavored. I thought, in my crazy brain, let's make a cheesecake, but like, kind of like a low carb one. I'm not even putting any sugar, allulose, anything in it because I don't have the stuff and I won't use it. But uh, cream cheese tastes really sweet to me. So if I was gonna do something fun, I'd do cheesecake. 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 Now, what am I gonna use for the crust? Guys, pork rinds. This is nutty, man. And we gonna mix them. Yes, we're gonna mix them. I'm gonna use my bear paws. I'm gonna like go for it. Yeah. Oops, I dropped your Batman. I'm sorry. Over here, I am going to crush some pork rinds up as the cheesecake crust. This, bear with me. This is gonna be really strange. It might be good. It might not be. Yeah. But we're gonna have some fun. You want a pork rind? Mm -hmm. Okay, right? Yeah. Had to look for my food processor. I had no idea where it was. Cool, mommy. I don't know if it's gonna work. I might not have plugged it in right. I'm not plugged in. <laughs> okay. Nick said it wasn't plugged in. Whoa. <laughs> Okay, now usually you put in softened butter to yeah. make it hold together. Just like, just like a cheesecake, but you're not using graham cracker. This is gonna be so weird. <laughs> if anything, we're having a fun adventure. Making something weird with Aaron. Oh shoot, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Erin, and that's Nixon, and today we are making cheesecake, but a weird carnivore one with pork meat. rinds. <laughs> he said, meat! <laughs> I'm gonna put some more pork rinds in here. This is gonna be so weird. It might be good. Oh man, it might be so good. Okay, now I'm drilling for it. It's gonna be delicious. Why not? We're looking for like a dough-like texture with it so you can like smush it together. Yeah, that's a good one. All right, so I'm actually gonna smush this Mommy. into the bears. So kind of like that. And I'm gonna go ahead and do all of them. Now I could have used my cheesecake pan, but I actually made them a real cheesecake just in case this one doesn't work out as well. I'm gonna go wash my hands. I did that before too, okay? You gotta wash your hands before you mess with stuff. Whoa. Okay, now we got that part done. All right, I'm gonna put, um, cheesecake recipes usually, cheesecake recipes usually ask for two of these. I have one, I wanna save the other one when I wanna try cloud bread again. What are you doing? Not for the internet, Nixon, put your shirt back on. <laughs> Could you open this for me? My hands are wet. See right here where it says open? You kind of peel your fingers open on both sides. It's kind of hard, but use your muscles. Use your finger muscles. You have to growl when you open it. You have to be like, rawr. Oh, I ripped it. Oh, oh, oops. Oh, 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 oh. oh, where's my orange spatula? Can you go get it? Or the blue one. All right, dropping the cream cheese into the bowl. Gotta make sure your cream cheese is room temperature. I'm so glad I have a helper. Now I can just sit on my butt and have him do all the work. <laughs> just kidding. Here. No, not kidding. No, yeah, put that up, please. I hear that. No, you didn't. Yeah, you, did, hear. you didn't hear anything. Yeah, I know you. You don't. You don't know me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I hear it. Here, throw that away, please. No, Thank no, you, sir. No. And and now it's time for yeah. a mint tea break. Man, this is like festive. We're doing like a pumpkin spice cheesecake. Okay, so this is pumpkin spice flavored cheese. 
and it, and it already has carbs in it, like 3% or something. So it's already like cheesy, right? Cheesy. Yeah. And then I didn't even look up the recipe, so I'm guessing you put sour cream in it too. So we're going to just plump some sour cream in there. I mean, Nikki wants to sing for us. That's nice. Thank you, Nikki. Nikki, could you put this in the fridge then? Thank you, love. You gotta watch your sour cream labels. Make sure it just says cultured cream enzyme. I never watched it before and I would buy the cheap or the Kroger brand ones and the Kroger brand isn't cream, isn't sour cream. Like, re you gotta read your labels, it sucks. It sucks, but you gotta do it. You gotta do it. Yeah. Could you put it in the fridge? I like my butter cold with my steaks. Thank you, buddy. You're so great. You're my best helper ever. All right, booby gooders. I'm thinking to separate the egg yolks from the whites. Okay. But the egg said no. I can. Yeah, I can. And I'm thinking like just four egg yolks in here. These are medium to large eggs. Chicken bucket. As we go. Hey. <laughs> I'm gonna do four. Oh. Okay, these are fresh. No, it Two. Here. We're at three. I don't know. She likes you to rake leaves. Go rake leaves. Go rake leaves for mom. Salt. Can you give me that pink salt right there? Alright. really creamy smells good what's wrong with it I bet it'll be good I'm gonna cook it at 350 I'll check it in 20 all right it's pretty thick <laughs> this is not gonna be weird well, maybe it'll be okay Maybe it'll be like savory. Maybe it'll just be weird. Well, if anything, it's like protein packed. That's for sure. So I guess cheesecake isn't really hard unless I missed something. I don't know. You guys should tell me. I don't know. <laughs> you missed the sweetener. I don't think it needs it, honestly, because the weird cheese that I just put in here Makes it like a pumpkin cheesecake, so that's totally pumpkin-y for the season, right? Honestly, if they turn out good, that's so awesome. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and spoon this in these paws, what I have left, and fill her up. I did actually make the kids a real cheesecake. And I, I used a sweetener for theirs. I hope they like it. So we got our paws filled up and I'm gonna put little trays under them and cook them in the oven, probably 350. I'll check them in 20 minutes and we'll see from there, I guess. All right. I heat it up to us. I heat it up to us. What is up, booby gooders? I got a hat. He looks a little scraggly. I washed him and I dried him, but he didn't. It didn't work so well. Here he goes. This one's blind in one eye. I noticed the right eye. There's no color. It's just like clear and opened, and there's nothing there. It's kind of interesting. Don't know how that happened. Puffed up some egg whites and just cooked them. That's what I did with the extra egg whites. All right, let's close up. These are done. Oh yeah, these are done. Oops, I touched it. Oh, I smushed it. I'm gonna put these in the refrigerator for two hours and taste them. What about Wolfman? <laughs> first couple kittens we had a bottle feed, like the first time ever doing it. They were so scratchy that we had to wrap them in the towel 
so they wouldn't scratch the crap out of our hands when we fed them. So there's a little thing. If you don't want them like trying to make biscuits on your fingers with their sharp little claws, with their sharp little claws, then wrap them in the towel. But right now, they're not too terrible. He was a little about it though. So you got to see all the kitties. I'm glad you got to see a little kitty update. Little baby, little kitty, the wolf man. Ow. What is up, booby goaters? It's been a few hours. This has cooled down, and we're going to pop it out and check it out. So here bop, we go. Bop, 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 bop. Just like a cheesecake, but with pork rinds as the bottom. Oh. Okay. Who wants to try it? I do. I do. No, wait, let me try it first, though, because I'm really interested in this. Here. Do we go? Do we go, Bob? I don't know if I like it. It is creamy. Try that. It's like a salty base. Oh. I don't like it. It's a Ew. pumpkin cheesecake. Uh, let's try one without the weird, uh -oh, without the pork rind. Ooh. Very low carb. I don't know how to make it, but it's kind of neat. It looks like it, though. <laughs> I like the one without the pork rind better, but, I, but when I had this one, I missed the crunch. Do you want to try the pork rind one? No. Okay. What are you doing? I can kind of taste the pumpkin spice. It's really creamy. It's fluffy with egg yolk. It's power packed. It's a little sour. I think that, uh, though, I think it's the cheese, the pumpkin spice cheese. Do you like it? Is it like a little sour? It's a little sour, yeah. That cheese has a little sourness to it. I don't know if I like it or not, and I keep eating it because it's filling me up. All right, booby gutters, I hope you have a great day. And if you want to try it, you can try it. It's, it's weird, for sure. But I kind of like it with the pork rind crust. So it's a little savory. It's sour, though, and it might be because of that cheese. It would taste really, really good if we what, we didn't add the pumpkin spice cheese to it. I think it would be really good, especially with just the pork rinds as the crust. Like, just eggs and cream cheese and pork rinds, butter, buttery pork rinds as the crust. I think that that's the thing. There's something there. I hope you guys have a great day, and um, this was fun. And I sat there and I ate, like, three, two. Eight two, almost three. Cause no, you still have the paw here. You can put it together like that. I only eight two, and I feel really full. So that was awesome. Thank you. Have a great day. It wasn't a win with the kids. Maybe with you. Thanks, Nick. I need the spotlight. I'm like a star. It's so sour. It's so sour. Why? Why is that cheese so sour? It's like a weird pumpkin sour cheese. Alright, we're good. Bye!